In this video, I'll guide you through installing PuTTY on your Windows computer and using it to connect to networked devices. First, download PuTTY from PuTTY.org. The link will be in the description. Click the Download PuTTY button, then choose the download link next to 64-bit x86. This is compatible with most Windows 10 and 11 systems. Once the download completes, run the install to launch the setup wizard. Click next and verify the installation location. Keep the default product features, ensuring that PuTTY's shortcut is added to your desktop. Click install. If a security prompt appears, select yes to allow changes to your device. When the setup finishes, uncheck view readme file and click finish. PuTTY supports three main connection types, SSH, Telnet, and Serial. The Serial option is particularly useful for connecting to network devices like Cisco equipment via a serial cable and accessing the terminal through the console port. To use PuTTY with a serial connection, first find the COM port number of your connected device. Open Device Manager, expand Ports, COM and LPT section, and note the COM port. Enter this COM port number into the serial line field in PuTTY. To save time in the future, save the session by naming it something like Serial Connection and click Save. This way, you won't need to check the COM port each time. To connect to your Cisco device or any network device, select the Saved Session and click Open to establish the connection, just as you would with an SSH session to an IP address on your network. Alright, that's how you install PuTTY and use it to connect to network devices.